Hey, hi, hello. So, what's up? It's Mark. Oh, there's a jump down the track. Metal jump. Um, yeah, so it's Tuesday, Toby Tuesday. Got lots of questions to answer. Didn't make it to Silver Lake Dunes this weekend. Unfortunately, we got sidetracked with dirt bikes and stuff, and we built a freestyle ramp. I don't know if you can see it way down there. So, yeah, we spent most of the weekend building that, me and Matt, a couple other guys. So we're gonna rip that, hopefully all week. I gotta build a big pile of dirt for a landing, but uh, I would've liked to go to the dunes, but I figured, you know, get this ramp done, start doing some freestyle stuff. So let's go grab Tobe and answer your guys' questions. Hello, Tobe. Look at this unit. <laughs> Looks a little beat up. Probably hit it on the quad. Jeez. Got a snowmobile track on it. I believe it's a sled jump, I take it. That's why these sliders and track are on here. But, uh, yeah, so our jump's done. Just have to get it painted. <clears throat> And we're gonna bring it down here. Let's hopefully build the landing over there. Should be pretty exciting. All right, let's do some questions. Question of the day. Put them all down. It's breezy out today. What do you think, Tobe? I try not to. It hurts too much. All right. Questions. Question, question, and answer. First one, Motokid40, where do I get my suspension done for my dirt bike? Uh, I got it done in Tilsonburg at MB1 Canada, or MB1 suspension. They did an awesome job. I thought, you know, stock suspension on my bike was pretty fun. And then I, I got it all dialed in and it was a hundred times better. Just for like everything, big jumps, little jumps, all the little bumps, every time you screw up. So, glad I got it done. Um, if anyone else wants, or I'll attach their link below if anyone wants to uh, check them out. Next question, Phaser6767. Where did you get your 408 number from? Well, <clears throat> kind of a long story, not really. Uh, when I was younger, I got a snowmobile. I wanted to get into racing, so I bought a, a Ski Doo 440 race sled, and it had the number 408 on it. And then I didn't really think much of it. And then I went out and started racing motocross, and I didn't have a number. So my dad said, "Why don't you be 408?" I was like, "All right." And then the YouTube thing started, and kind of just stuck to me like glue. So. Now, now I'm Mark Freeman, 408. That's me. Next question. Hayden Good, Goodmanson. Would you get a long track or do you prefer short track snowmobiles? Toby prefers a short track. I'm just kidding. Uh, well, around here it's pretty flat, so there's no point in me getting a long track. I don't live in the mountains. <clears throat> I'm just a trail bagger. Right, Toby? So it just makes sense for me to have a short track around here. Works well. Uh, next question, Austin Roberts. How nervous were you when you first skydived? Uh, not that nervous. I was actually more nervous when I second, my second jump, I guess. First jump I did with a, I did tandem with an instructor. So it was in his hands and you know, I figured he was a professional, so he wasn't gonna kill me. But yeah, second time I jumped, when I jumped by myself was scary because I knew it was all on me. So a little more scary, but I don't actually get scared anymore skydiving. So I just, you know, it's fun. It's my thing. All right. <clears throat> Final question. Elite Gaming, what's the next boat you're going to get? Well, I'd like to get one either next year or the year after. See how well YouTube treats me. But, uh... It's going to be a Mastercraft for sure. We just sold our Tig, 
and it was a great boat, but I would never get one again or suggest anyone getting one. You know, we had a lot of problems with it and uh, a lot of warranty work that they didn't want to cover. So their customer service was not that well. Not, you know, I love the boat, but it was just, I wouldn't, I wouldn't get another one for sure. I'd get a Mastercraft, so. Anyways, thanks for the questions. Toby, you're very pale. Oh, there you go. But uh, got anything to say? Wrap it up. You know, keep wa keep on wagon, walking, watch for zombies, something like that. <laughs> All right, guys, take care.